let's guess let's see a new example suppose we have a list right a list is there i take the list name lst1 some values are there 10 20 30 right 40 that right? rl i'll take the values number 11 right 12 14 right 20 then 9 8 like this now oh, fun guys here now we have a list from this list uh, from this list uh, i want to get only even numbers uh, into another list uh, into another list uh. suppose uh, the output should be like this then new list uh, i want only even numbers like a uh, 10 then 12 next uh, 14 is there next uh, 20 is there next uh, 8 is there that's all all of right uh, see this is my input it is my input and uh, this is what uh, i want the output uh, for this one i want to write a function i want to write a function guys here right i'll take now def i take for example the function name display i take the function call also same name or right? a display right so in the function call we take the this actual parameter right uh, i take the list one here we take the list one okay list one we take the list one list one now so guys here the same list one now it should pass to which one now? the function definition right so it's going there same list one now. we can take same name or we can take the different name guys now we can take same name or a different name i'm trying to display the same list one now. let us see whether the same output the same data will be there or anything changing is there right now all of observe here all of observe now okay right so what is happening here the same came right same came as it is the same list came as it is right same list came as it is means uh, our data is passing right this is the actual our list right list uh, which variable now lst right uh, that is taken to the which one uh, into the function call as a actual argument from there it's going to the function definition as a formal argument then uh, it's going to the body in the body currently what is there in the body only displaying is there that's why the same one right same one uh, is displaying as it is the same one displaying as here okay our input data assigned to one variable that variable right is taking the function call as a actual parameter that one uh, is going to the function definition as a formula parameter or formal argument that formal argument uh, we use in the function body right uh, same i am using print of lst1 uh, the same thing guys now displaying here same thing displaying here okay right but what i want here i don't want display i don't want display same list as it is what i want here i want to filter out all even numbers uh, then i want to display only even numbers of the given list okay right so now on this list one formal argument uh, i'm going to apply the for loop now why for loop for to fetch one by one to fetch one by one right now guys currently currently in the lst1 the lst1 what is available currently what is the lst1 data i'm taking the same right as it is is all data available currently in the lst1 that's all guys now all of right so this is the data of which one this is data of which one this lst1 now on this lst1 i am going to apply for loop nothing but uh, on this data i am going to apply for loop right why for loop uh, to bring one by one to get a uh, one by one uh, for i in uh, right lst1 uh, for i in uh, lst1 now what is the first time i value what is the first time i value observe here now so all of you see now from lst1 uh, i am taking the one by one element right uh, what is lst1 uh, this is the lst1 right this is the lst1 now what is data available lst1 now this list is right list is there this list is there means uh, so from here guys now it takes first element uh, it takes first element guys right it takes first element uh, and the first element here 10 now so first time my value is 10 now first time my value is uh, 10 now 10 now on that 10 now i check it now whether the 10 is even number or odd number i will check it now whether the first time 10 is coming 
that time I won't check it now, whether even number or odd number. Next time uh, 11 will come. I'll check it uh, whether 11 is even number or odd number. Next time 12 will come, 14 will come, right? Uh, 20, 8, uh, 9, 5, all one by one come. And each one will check it here, whether even number or odd number. If it's even number, take in the a new list in the output. Uh, if it's odd number, they will skip it, okay? Right. Now, what's first my value here now? The first my value is how much here now? The first my value is 10 now, okay? I value is 10 now. Right, 10 now. The 10 I'm checking now. If I modulus 2, double equal to 0, double equal to double equal to 0, right, 0, then now, what is the meaning here? It is even number. It is a even number, right? Even number. I can display simply print of i that's all print of i right print of i now what happens guys here now display all even numbers are one by one displaying all like first at c now now how it works internally means now all of observe here so what's first time uh guys here what is lst lst means uh, right this data this data okay same lst means which one uh? lst one means uh this data okay now so first time guys here what is the i value now so first time 10 right 10 is coming means first time i value is 10 now first time right i value is 10 okay first time uh, observe guys now what's first time i value i value is 10 now then 10 modulus 2 equal 0 now this one true or false this one uh, true or false right if it is true if if it is true if it is true then uh, it excludes uh, its block uh, it's a block otherwise just skip the block skip the block here why skipping here because we don't have the else block right else block is not there only simply if is there simply if means uh, if condition is true execute the block up condition is false uh, skip the block that's all okay but currently condition is true because uh, 10 modulus to equal 0 only true that's why now execute the body uh, if body what is their print of i What's the value guys now? What's the value 10 now? That's why 10 is coming here. That's all. Okay. 10 came. 10 came. And uh, in the print guys now, in the print actually see. Actually, the print means uh, how it is there. Object guys now, right? Print of. I have taken the i. That's all. This is what we have taken, right? Uh, we have taken like this. Uh, but internally, uh, i comma n d equal to n d equal to what is the guys now? Something, right? Slash n is there. And equal to some slash n slash n is there guys now slash n is there and equal to slash n what slash n here means a new line right new line that's why automatically the cursor will come to the new line uh, and waiting here i'll observe now the cursor come to china so actual cursor is there after i printing after i printing after i printing right printing a uh, cursor move forward uh, generally but what is there and equal to slash n now so miss new lane now cursor will come and waiting uh, waiting here the cursor waiting here right now this block is over right this block is over now means uh, if is over right if if is over now miss uh, not if uh, uh, if is over right if is over now take the next i value now take the next i value now second i value here now second i value 11 right 11 guys now second time uh, what's i value i value is 11 second time i value 11, right now so if 11 modulus to equal to true sorry modulus to equal to zero true or false it's false right it's false skip it now that's all skipping here if it is true means execute the body false means skip the block right skip the block skipping over uh, skipping means uh, take next iteration what next i value here right uh, 12 12 right uh, now i value is 12 next i value how much here i value is 12 12 now so 12 modulus to equal to 0 true or false true only just start the block there what is there now print of what's the value 12 so now guys uh, 12 displayed here you can see right now 12 displayed 12 displayed and the cursor move forward but what is the uh, default parameter in the printer and equal to slash m now so cursor come to the new line and waiting here and the uh, waiting the right waiting there now the if is over right if block over if is over now take the new iteration next next iteration right uh, 
the next value it means next i value next i value 14 right next i value is 14 all of you observe so next i value is 14 what is i value right 14 now 14 modulus to equal 0 true or false or true true then uh, start the block the block what is the print of i what is i value what is i value here at 14 okay then guys here 14 will display cursor waiting here right cursor waiting here so 14 will display and uh, end equal slash n uh, so automatically cursor comes to the new line actually cursor is there here but uh, because of the parameter come to the new line uh, now cursor is there here right cursor is there now if you write if is over right if is over means uh, now state the next iteration now take the next iteration right next iteration now uh, for next value here next value 20 all of you observe here next i value 20 okay next i value 20 next uh, 20 is coming guys here now what's i value now 20 now 20 modulus equal 0 true or false uh, yes true only right true only they start the block uh, what is their print of i this print of 20 right uh, now 20 will display here 20 will display display here because cursor is there here cursor is there that's why it displays here wherever cursor is there their value will display right uh, now to display uh, again uh, cursor move forward uh, but what is the default uh, end equal to slash n uh, that's why cursor comes next line uh, and cursor waiting here cursor waiting in the new line uh. okay now this block was over right if it's over or uh, take the new iteration right <coughs> means uh, new new i value what is i value eight uh, next i value how much right i value is eight uh. next i value is how much here Right, next i value guys observe now 8 okay next i value is uh, uh, 8 uh, next i value how much here okay 8 guys now next i value is 8 okay now if 8 modulus to equal 0 true or false or true only true means start the block again now start the block so now that i value will display what is i value now 8 uh, 8 displayed here now move the cursor and uh, general next line goes actual right uh, uh, next uh, now the if is over right if is over now take the again a uh, new iteration start the new iteration new iteration right uh, next i value right here nine okay next i value nine is there now observe guys right next i value nine uh, nine coming now nine, nine coming here now i value is nine now nine modulus to equal zero true or false 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 means uh, there skip the block that's all skip the block okay next iteration for next i value again uh, Next value 5, right? Next I value 5. Now, so next I value 5. Now 5 modulus to equal 0. Now, true or false, this one. True or false. False, right? False. False again. Skip it. Again, skip it, right? Uh, next value. Next I value. Next I value here. Uh, now any value is there? No value is there. Now, means for I, there's no value. No value here. So automatically, it will terminate the loop. As long as I get the values, it executes. Once I not getting the value, it automatically terminates the loops. It will stop the loops. That's all. It will stop the specific loop. And now it come out of the for loop. Now it terminates the entire for loop guys. Now that's why the output is 10, 12, 14, 20, and 8. And 8 guys. Now this is the how the flow is going on. The flow is going on. Okay, fine, but, but, so what I want here, I don't want display one by one. I don't want display, right, one by one. I want all in the a list, right, like this, I want output, uh, list of, uh, see, same output only, same values only, but uh, I want the list format, right, I want in this format. Uh, I want in the, which format, right, list format, guys, now, in the list format. So that's why, what do I do here? I take a new list now. I take suppose LST2, list 2. I take some empty list, right? Empty list. Now, so whatever is even number, that even number, I don't want to print every time. That even number, I add to the list one. I add to the one. I add to the list two. I add to the new list. How to add? How to add here? Observe now. Observe here. List two dot append of append of right append of i append of i means every time uh, without the even number coming uh, that even number uh, appending to the list two appending means uh, adding uh, at the end uh, adding uh, at the end so first time 10 will add uh, next uh, 12 will add uh, next 14 will add uh, 
20 will add, 8 will add, 1 by 1 will add like that. After all iterations over, I want the final output, right? Final output. Uh, that's why, that's why, right? Uh, we'll take the uh, print where out of the for loop as in. I'm taking outside the for loop now. I'm taking the list to two outside the for loop. Means uh, after all iterations over, then I want to display the result of the list to two. That's all, guys. Now, now let us try here. Now you can see output, right? You can see the output, guys. Now you can see the, the result, okay? Our same output came as it is, guys. Here, what I'm expecting, uh, same came as it is, right? Same came as it is, uh, the list format only in the, in the list format only. You got the output, uh, you got the output, guys. That's all. You got the output, okay? Right now, for this one, guys, now all of observe, all of observe here the same program explain again observe now now all of you observe here so uh, so we are taking the here we are taking now first i value at i value next i'm taking now next i'm taking now if if then i'm taking here uh, a list two right list two guys now i'm taking these two now I'm taking these two i value if uh, under list of two one by one now i'll show you guys now and already list one what list one here list one has uh, this data list one has uh, this data okay right now that list one also I'll take now guys that list one also i take separately here i'm taking the right uh, list one or also okay no problem here list one is there okay list one is there now that's first time what's the i value now First time, what's the i value, right? Uh, from the list one now. Okay, from the list one. What's list one, guys? Here, and this one is the list one. Now. How this one comes uh, here? Uh, it's coming like this. It's coming like this, guys. Now, all of you mute the mic. All of you please mute the mic. All of you please mute the mic. It's coming like this. Okay, it's coming here from the taking the values uh, like this, guys. Now, okay. Right, so now, so all of you observe here, now all of you observe here, I take all, all of you, please uh, don't unmute the mic, okay? So when I use the, when I use the, this zoom, right, uh, this, uh, this uh, tool to read the, to read the data, this tool, right, uh, zoom tool, uh, okay, if I, uh, if I zoom out, uh, automatically that entire diagram will disappear. That's why in the middle guys now, right, uh, don't unmute the mic, okay? Right. Now, all of you, I'm taking the i value here. I'm taking the i value. I'm taking now if I'm taking now list to two guys. Okay, list to two. Now, just observe guys. Now, very interesting this one. Right. So, uh, what's first time i value? First time i value, how much now? Right, 10. 10 is the first time i value, guys. Now, 10 is the first time i value. Right. Now, if it's true or false, with i value 10 na with i value 10 na uh, if is true or false uh, see now if is true or false check there if is true or false uh, if is true if is true if, if is true then now uh, what i what happening here that i value that i value append to the lst2 so previously what is lst2 it is the empty right it's empty list empty list previously it's the empty list right the, now the empty list I'm adding the which one now? I'm appending the 10 guys now. Append the 10, that's all. Append the 10 now. Append the 10. Okay. Now appending over, appending over, right? Up to here over. Now take the again new iteration now. Take the new iteration. The new iteration means new i value. What new new i value guys here? The new value is 11, right? 11. The next i value is 11 guys. Subject now all of you. I'm taking one by one now and I'll show you now. What next i value next i value is 11 next i value 11 now right 11 now with the 11 i value if is true or false if is false if is false right if is false means see if is false means no appending here right no appending if is false means no appending here no appending here why no appending if is false means you don't execute the board right that's why guys here right no appending at this time, uh, no board executing. I take here no opening like this. Fine. Now, guys, here now. So if it's false, uh, now take the new iteration. Start the new iteration here. Right. What next I value? What next next I value? Guys, right. Next I value twelve. Next I value is twelve. Right. Next I value is uh, 
12 guys now. Now 12 is coming. Now with I value 12, with I value 12, let I value 10. Now if is true or false now. If is true or false. If is true, right? If is true. If is a if is true. If if is true, then execute the block uh, block of if. Already in the list two, what is available? Already 10 is right, 10 is available already. Which is available, 10 is available. Now for same data appending the current i value. What's current i value? 12. So now 12 will append guys now. Now this time already, already, right? What is there? Already 10 is there. Now 12 appending. 12 appending. That's all. Enough. Now the block is over. Next one, next block. Right? Next iteration, guys. Now next iteration here, right? But next i value now, next i value is 14. Okay. Next i value 14. See, all observe now, right? One by one coming. One by one coming here, right? I value is 14. <clears throat> okay, 14. Now, with that I value, uh, the if is true or false now. I value is 14 now. Now, uh, if is true or false, uh, right? If is true. Now, right? If is uh, if is true, guys, now. If, if is true, then execute the block, right? Execute the block. Now, already in the last two, what is available in list two? Already 10, 12 is there. For that one, uh, append the current I value. Which one? Uh, Current I value right uh, 14, right? 14 appending. What uh, current I value 14 uh, appending here? Okay, appending guys, 14 appending. Now, guys, observe here already. What is there? 10 is there, 12 is there, now uh, 14 appending. That's all. So, guys, now the size increasing, right? Only one element uh, now, two elements uh, now, three. See, size increasing. Okay, right. <clears throat> Next one uh, now, so the appending over, right? Appending over. Next block means next iteration. What next I value guys now? Right at 20. Next I value is 20. Okay. Now 20 is coming now. Next I value 20. Next I value how much? Right? 20. Now, so with I value 20, with I value 20, the if is true or false now. If is true, right? Uh, the if is true. If is true. If if is true, then uh, execute the block. Now append of I. What's current I value? 20. 20 append to which one? 20 append to which one? Uh, LST2. In LS2, what is available already? 10, 12, 14 available, right? 14 available. Uh. Now, guys, observe now. So, already, already 10 is there, 12 is there, and 14 is there. Now, how much appending? Uh? 20 appending. 20, right? 20 appending. Uh. Okay. Now, the block over. The block over. Next, guys, now, next, uh, next iteration here, right? Uh, the block over. Next iteration is the Next I value, what is I value? 8, okay. Next I value is 8, 8. Now all of the here, next I value is 8 coming. Next I value, how much, right? 8. So next I value is 8. With 8, with I value 8, I value 8, if is true or false now. If is a true or false, okay. True or false. If is true, right? If is true. If, if is true, then execute the block, right? Execute the block. So already in the LS2, what is available? Uh, is available currently, right? Uh, on that one, uh, append the I value. What's I value currently? Eight. Uh, now it is appending. Okay, it is appending guys here. Now that's why here the output is a uh, 10 comma 12 comma 14 comma 20. Then eight that's all. Then uh, eight enough. Now the block over, right? Block over. Now the block over. Next I value. What next I value here? Next I value 9, right? 9 is coming now. Next I value, what's coming, right? 9 is coming. <coughs> right? 9 is coming, guys, now. Now, with I value 9, with I value 9, the if is true or false now, if is false. If is, if is false. If, if is false means no block execution. Why? Because if is false means skip the block. It would execute the block. It execute the block if, if is true. Now, so the if is a uh, skip the block right next i value take next iteration what next i value five right next i value is five next i value is five guys observe now next i value is how much here it is the five next i value is the five now with i value five in the for loop uh, if it's true or false now if is false okay if is false guys now if is a uh, false if if is false uh, then uh, the block execution not uh, not possible, not possible. Let's right? see. Whenever the if is false, uh, no execution, guys. Now no block execution. When uh, if uh, if is false, uh, okay, right. 
next next i value guys now that it is skipped right skipped the block skip next i value in i value is there no i value now no i value means uh, for i the value is not coming for i value is not coming then immediately guys now it uh, it skip the for loop now it uh, terminate the for loop it terminate the for loop our for loop next what is there here print of lst2 print of lst2 what is lst2 currently it is lst2 that will print that's why the same output guys we got it right the same output you can see right same you can see whatever you are expecting a uh, same came guys now 10 12 14 28 14 28 guys that's all it is the how guys internally it executes up it executes up okay suppose guys now suppose observe now the same printer right the same printer if i take if i take here as part of the if the same print i take outside the for loop, for loop right if i take inside the inside the for then uh, displays first 10 displays uh, next this will display uh, it will display it will display it will all will display now because uh, the print also part of for loop uh, means print also will re-execute will re-execute that's why displays are uh, 10 uh, next displays are uh, 10 12 uh, displays are uh, 10 12 14 uh, 10 12 14 20 10 12 14 28 uh, all displays one by one when if you take if in the for loop, I have taken the outside for loop, that's why displaying the only final output only, displaying the only the final output only, guys. Now that's all. Okay, so this is the how guys uh, this functional executes internally. Okay, right. Now run this one. And this one, you can see guys, that same uh, output came here. You can take different values also guys now i can take suppose now different values i take suppose uh, 23 24 uh, 14 uh, 14 uh, right uh, next uh, uh, 34 uh, 55 uh, right some 68 uh, okay yeah, 100 uh, you can take number of elements now you can take n number of elements like this guys uh, now it repeats for all uh, it repeats for all right uh, uh, right now observe guys here yes you can see now so what happened now all all even numbers came now all even numbers came all even numbers came guys okay 